Okay, here we are upstairs. Again, neutral colors on all the walls. You have kind of a Jack and Jill bathroom that connects this bedroom uh, with the other one. This bedroom here to the right is the master, which is in the back of the house. You have one bedroom that's right there. Got a bathroom in between that connects to this bedroom, which is at the front. So we'll start here. Again, you'll see carpets have been cleaned, look to be in good shape, nothing majorly wrong, or I think you could totally work with this. The, the house, basically, I think you can put a sign up and start renting it. If you wanted to do a little bit of touch-up painting, you probably could. There's two closets here, one is right there, and then you have another one right here. Again, the, the walls look to be in nice shape. You've got a shower tub combination right here. That's very clean. And then over here on the side is the vanity. Just kind of a basic light up there. And then the flooring is just linoleum, the vinyl flooring, um, which is basic. So then I'm coming into this other bedroom right here. It's got kind of a weird accent wall right there, but then the rest is all neutral. Traditional size closet here on the side. Again, carpet looks to be in good shape. No issues. Whoops. Uh, right there. And then now let's go over to the master. We've just made a circle right there of the stairs. And the master has a real nice big couple of windows that overlook to the back, the lake, and the field and the forest there. Got a ceiling fan up top. Walls are all relatively neutral. Just a decent sized walk-in closet here. And then here's the master bathroom. You've got the traditional kind of basic light, standard cabinetry, vinyl flooring, shower tub combination. So, again, I think you could stick a sign up and be done on this one, uh, which is great.